Hello, my name is Anton and this time I will show you how to experiment with Kadana linters on your machine using a convenient common line utility. It is the easiest way to start with Kadana and depending on your operating system you can choose the installation option or even just download the binary and use it without any special installation procedure. I'm using Mac so I have installed it using Homebrew Package Manager but before installing it, make sure you have Docker installed on your local machine. Now let's see how to use this utility. I have a clone of OKHttp OK library. It is a very popular library in the JVM ecosystem with a lot of code. And by the way, Kadana also supports PHP, Python, JavaScript, .NET, and even Go. But OKHttp OK is a fairly large project, and I hope to see analysis results with various issues. First, let's just type kadana command in the command line. It prints the usage information with a list of available commands and options. I recommend configuring completion for your convenience so that it's easier to operate when you are composing the commands in the terminal. So if I type kadana help and completion, I get the instructions for configuring completion for various shells, including Bash, Fish, PowerShell, and Z shell. So let's start working on the project now. To create the initial configuration, I can use the kadana init command that will ask for some additional information. On the start, it checks if there is a new version of this utility and provides you the information for the update. If we choose to proceed, it will ask which linter I want to use for this project. Various linters come with various sets of inspections depending on the technology stack. I'm going to select the community option this time and uh, proceed. The utility generates Kadana YAML configuration file. Now we can use Kadana scan command to analyze the project. This will be the main command when you work with Kadana, so it makes sense to explore the options. As you can see, we can use plenty of flags for configuring the command. I am going to use a few flags this time for demonstration. First, after the analysis, I want to display the report. Hence, I'm adding the show report option. For serving the report, the utility will run a small HTTP server on a port 8080. And sometimes I want to override this port because I might need to run multiple commands. Therefore, I usually add the port option and specify the port number explicitly. I also want to print all the problems that Kadana finds. There are plenty of options that we can use with the scan command in Kadana, but I'm not going to cover all of them in this video. However, I want to highlight here the option for setting a profile name. The profiles define a set of inspections that the linter will run for the project. Inspection profiles is an important topic to understand, so there will be a, a dedicated video for this. For now, we just need to understand that there are three profiles built into Kadana by default. There is a sanity profile with the initial checks. It verifies if the project is capable for analysis. The starter profile includes a minimal set of inspections. It's just a quick check if you want to quickly verify if there are no major issues in the project. And finally, there is a recommended profile that includes a pre-selected set of IntelliJ inspections. This is the profile I want to use right now. So the profile name option enables the profile I specify. The utility will pull the required Docker image for the linter we have selected and start the analysis phase. On the first run, it will download many dependencies and it will take some time, but the subsequent executions will be faster as the dependencies are cached. So once the analysis is complete, it will open the browser window with the report. For this project, Kadana found a number of problems and now we can inspect the issues by category by using the interactive filters in the report. We can see there is 46 critical issues and a list of all these issues are below. So we can check if it's something that we want to fix immediately. Our next videos will dive into the various inspections 
in more detail. That's all folks. If you want to try Kadana locally on your favorite project, consider command line Kadana utility to start quickly. Let me know in the comments if it was useful. Thank you for watching and keep your projects clean.